everyone welcome to my amazon live channel my name is atara and i'm gonna be talking about tech today i have i don't know i just wanted to talk about all of the things i have gathered and got over the past 2021 and um make a stream about it <laughs> oh speaking of which my computer is off i should probably turn on my computer behind me i'll be right back Okay, while I wait for that to load, I'm just wearing some very lazy clothes today. It's super cold. So, the first thing I want to talk about that's right <laughs> is the Sony A7R camera. I really like the Sigma 60mm f1.4 lens on this camera. Hey, Kobe! But this camera is amazing. Happy New Year, you guys! I didn't do my hair or makeup because I did my hair really intense yesterday and it hurt. <laughs> Maybe I will do my makeup or something. But, uh... Was that the camera you brought to Vegas? It's different from the one I brought to Vegas. This one's better than the one I had in Vegas, but... Um, this one's actually Myth's camera. But I like to borrow it. I like to use his camera because, like I said, it is a lot better than mine. And mine is so good, though. Like, the ca the pictures I took in Vegas were super good, but this one is way better. Hey, buddy. How you doing today? Oh, yeah. I also wanted to build um, a Pokemon. So, I have Mewtwo. I have Mewtwo and I have uh, Mimikyu. But... I couldn't find Mimikyu in the Amazon products, so I think I'll have to build Mewtwo today because he's the only one I could find. Which I'm actually kind of excited because I already have a Mew, so I can make a Mewtwo. Um, yeah, yeah, Myth is really good at photography. It's so crazy because our styles in photography are so different. Like, my style of photography is I like to do either, like, I like to do, like, super, like, fluffy and like airy like princessy looking stuff and charles is, oh sorry miss photography is very like um dark yeah you should he would probably love to who do you think you are giovanni yes i am giovanni we're making a mewtwo today i'm excited hey isaac how's your day today I made some, I baked some homemade raisin cinnamon bread today. And then I also made those peanut butter bar things that I like. Except for, I made it with 100% dark chocolate and it is intense. Um, milk chocolate is definitely more tasty than 100% dark chocolate, but I tried. You heard it here first. Um, I have got my Samsung monitor behind me. The Samsung... 49 inch odyssey g9 i um what was i gonna say about that i want to lower my cameras more but in order to do that i have to take the wheels off of this the stand and that's a lot of work because i have to take everything off and then put it back on so i'm not gonna do that how do i ask myth to post photos i would just be like um, just, just post something like, hey, a terrace is your photographer. Uh, can I see some of your photos? It's just like that, I would say. Oh, oh, I've posted some photos that he's taken. So, I'll, on my Instagram, a lot of photos that are just of me, Myth has taken of me. And they're really good. 60%? Yeah, I should have got, yeah, 100% is way too dark. I should have got at least, yeah, probably 60%. Last time I put 80% and it was delicious, actually, because I think uh, the bitterness with the, like, peanut butter sweetness was, like, a really good, like, contrast. Uh, but 100% is, like, way too strong. Um, I'm gonna go over here real fast. What do do? And my chair has this thing. It's so cool. I go like this. But, um, you guys didn't see that pin, right? But, uh, this is 
Samsung Odyssey G9 monitor. I need to play more games on it. I haven't been playing games in a minute and I really should. I don't know what I want to play. I don't know what I want to play. I'm lost. Hey, Propane, how you doing today? I can post some photos he's taken of me to Discord so you can see. I've edited them though, so like he took them, but I edited them. So it's not his style of editing, but... Man, my hair looks long today. I don't know what's going on. Oh, do you like Halo Infinite? Ah, oh, so I ordered online, I ordered a Go XLR, another Go XLR, but instead of the big Go XLR that I have over here, I bought a Go XLR Mini. So I'm really excited to use the Go XLR Mini because I did get the Shure SM7B microphone. Uh, right here, oh, I almost dropped it. I did get the Shure SM7B microphone and I want to use it, but I can't because I don't have a uh, audio interface. So. I'm excited for that, um, for that Go XLR Mini to come in. I bought it from Korea and not Amazon. This is your first time seeing an Amazon, a uh, live stream on Amazon. What is this for? So basically Amazon Live is kind of made so if you have any questions about products that I have, I can kind of like break it down for you and um, kind of help you out a little bit more. So like for example, let's say you're like, I want to buy some iPad, wait, these are i. <laughs> what are these called? AirPods. <laughs> Whoops. If you're like, I want to buy some AirPods and I'm like, oh, I have AirPods. And then you ask me like specific questions, like what are the range of the AirPods? How many devices can I connect it to? Then I can kind of give you my insight from personally having experience with the product. And that's pretty much what Amazon Live is for. Um, I have had the Shure SM7B before, but I got another one. And I want to hook it up to this computer right here, my streaming computer that's in front of me, but I don't have an audio interface. So I just recently bought a Go XLR Mini and then I can talk about that and I'm excited. I do really like the Go XLR. I feel like it was a bit much. Wait, where is it? Right here. <laughs> do I know any good small gaming chairs? Not at the moment. Uh, if you, <laughs> I'm trying to get rid of mine. The don't cost a kidney it's so hard i don't know i don't know um i would say just get one of those office chairs they're like so comfortable oh another thing this is one of my favorite things that i've added to my pc setup in 2021 is those lights that are behind me those lights that just keep going back and forth behind me are honestly some of my favorite thing it's this way sorry it's mirrored so i'm like which way do i flip um, these lights right here are like my favorite lights. They're the Govi Glide RGBIC lights. Um, thank you. Nice to meet you, Chris. Thank you for stopping by my Amazon live stream. Ah, another thing that I love that I got during, uh, this isn't really, sorry, it's like fuzzy. Hey, focus. Um, this isn't tech, it's tech related, but it's not tech. But, uh, this right here, the Peak Design Clutch is like one of my favorite things that I bought this year. It is so awesome for taking photos. Um, I bought it so that when I went to Disneyland with my little brother, I could take photos and not have to be scared about dropping my camera because I really, uh, I don't know, I'm just really scared of dropping it. Like as you can see right here, the handle's quite small and when it's super heavy, it, um, I don't know. I'm just really worried that I'll drop it. So I bought one of these. And it's the best thing ever. I do have a YouTube, but I don't YouTube very often. I have some ideas of some YouTube videos I do want to make soon, though. Um, I can set this up, though, and show you guys. Uh, I also got this, which is a capture clip. Hold on. I think this one opens up and you can see it. So it looks like this. I also got this as well. Um, so I could basically just like clip my camera to my belt and then like pull it off and then like not have to worry about carrying around heavy camera bags or anything. Honestly, best decision I've ever made. <laughs> I'm going to go over here to my table. So here's the camera. Look at this cool little, uh, thing I got. It was like five bucks. 
<laughs> it's like just the little statue of David that holds my makeup brushes. But uh, let's open this up. That's awesome. Thank you for helping him, Isaac. So here's the clutch and I'm gonna put it onto this camera. The only bad thing about this clutch is, literally the only bad thing is the fact that um, it's a little small for my hands. Or sorry, a little too big for my hands. My hands are small. <laughs> too small for this, I guess. Oh, you're looking for a birthday gift for your sister? Oh, it's January 9th? Oh, it's soon. That's sweet of you. Oh, darn it, I need scissors. What did I do with my scissors? I will be right back while I go and find scissors. I usually always have my scissors right there, but I moved them. Okay, I somehow managed to lose my scissors again. <laughs> it's like the sixth time. I might have to buy more scissors. <laughs> but I found a box cutter, so I'll just box cut this. Oh, wait. Did I want to box cut this one? <laughs> I have two of these. I, I Okay, this doesn't make sense, but I accidentally bought three of these. Um... What am I watching? So I am unboxing this, uh, this right here, this clutch by Peak Design, and then I'm going to attach it to the camera and kind of like show you guys how it works. And the reason why I bought it and stuff. But yeah. Nice to meet you, I am no one. What did I do? No! I have too many things, this is bad. I'll just open it. I have, I accidentally, like I said, I accidentally bought three of these. So one of them, the box is all beat up and I wanted to, I wanted to use the one with the beat up or open the one out of the beat up box since it's all messed up and stuff. And then like keep the nicer box, like just chilling. I honestly don't know where I put it though, to be honest, it's gone. Oh, you're leaving? Okay, bye, Kobe. Yeah, um, I'll post some pictures and tag you in it. Oh, look at that. It has a nice little pull thing, pull tab. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kobe. So this is what's in the box. It's got instructions here on how to set everything up. And it tells you like different things you can do, like the clip, you can have it with the clip, you can have it like this. Which is actually, I did do that for my setup too. And this has the other stuff inside. So we need to detach this. And I forgot how to do that. I think we gotta push this in. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, he does. Dramatic realism, very dramatic. Okay, I have another idea. We're gonna do this. Hi, Angela. Uh, so I can't give you my email over Amazon Live, but if you message me on Instagram, I can tell you it over there. So here's our clutch. It's super comfortable, super good quality too. And then it's gonna come with a few things. So it's gonna come with an extra one of these, which I should take off the other one. And then inside the bag, we've got this, which goes on the bottom of our camera, a bigger square clip, which is very helpful if you have like the Sony camera, like I have, cause Sony camera has kind of like this bigger loop and it's kind of a pain to get on. Um, or if you just want two of them, you can easily just add it to that one. <laughs> right, right, bunny? 
I'm excited to make that Mewtwo though. I was hoping today that I could finally upgrade my laptop. Uh, because I've been talking about how I'm going to upgrade my laptop with a 2 terabyte NMVE SS... Uh, sorry. NMVE N.2. Um, and I haven't gotten around to it yet. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to take the camera, flip it over, and I'm going to screw this on. Swoop, doo -dee -doo, doo -dee -doo. Um, what's amazing about this clip that I didn't know until actually recently is it works with so many like clips. It's awesome. It's amazing. So I've used it with like, uh, for example, I have these clips on all of my cameras so I can easily take them on and off. And these work perfectly with those. Okay, next I gotta try and get this thing off because it is kind of a pain. Yeah, one of these days I should do another cooking stream because it was really fun. I don't know what I could cook though. I don't know if you guys are interested in anything. Oh, actually, you know what? I should take this off for now. This is a clip for a, uh, what do you want to call it? Yes. <laughs> for a lanyard. Lanyard? Camera lanyard thingy. Nick, you know, a lanyard thingy. I can't English, I forgot. <clears throat> okay, come on. Ramen! Ooh, I could make Japanese style ramen. If I do, I'm gonna have to make homemade noodles. And that is actually something that's really fun to make. Yeah, this one's just a tad bit bigger, so I'm gonna switch this out. Um, <clears throat> ramen is, uh, the noodles for ramen is super simple to make. You just need to make sure you have a flour that's high in protein so you can stretch it. If I can show you, and it's a lot of fun. I could do that someday. That's a lot of setup though. So uh, if I do make some like Japanese style ramen, uh, I really have to prepare for that stream. The angle I'm trying to add this to is like really weird. There we go. Sorry about that. What is your name, Chris? I think Chris's name is Chris. And then we will just kind of loop this through here. Oh, wait, I'm putting it in the wrong way. What are other styles of ramen? You can have Japanese, or sorry, Korean style ramen, which is so different from Japanese style. Uh, but it's still good in its own way. It's really spicy and they use the instant noodles. Um, but they also have like bude chige and bude chige is uh, a ramen that uh, it's like a ramen. It is ramen, but it's a weird type of soup altogether. Bude chige has actually got a really sad story, <laughs> which is weird that a ramen has a sad story. But uh, bude chige is a... Uh, Basically, during the Korean War, all of the, um, when the American military was here, the Koreans were really poor and starving. So the Americans gave them random food. So they gave them like spam and hot dogs and dry ramen. <clears throat> and uh, what else, what else, what else? Uh, sausages, tater tots, stuff like that. And then they, put it all into a soup together and it's called bude chige. It's really good. Not very healthy whatsoever, but really good. Hey, brain slugs, it's good to see you. I'm setting up this clutch. Okay, so I gotta, gonna just put this on its head real fast and then I'm gonna loop it through. You know what, I should've done this beforehand. Frantically searching my room for seed cables because my your laptop's gonna die. I hope you find them Okay, so I'm just gonna loop this through here Yeah, my uh, I charged I try to charge all of my devices at nighttime What I want to do when maybe someday is just set up like a little area That's just like a charging hub so like every night I can just have all of my stuff there and just like at night just like be like, okay, you're charging. Uh, 
Um, okay. And then you just kind of loop this through here, like so. And then the clutch is on your camera. And this is how it looks. Um, I have to tighten up mine a ton, but it's really nice to just have that stability when you're taking photos. Cause then I really don't feel like I'm gonna be dropping my camera, especially when I have like a super heavy lens on it. Trying to tighten up the most I can. But this is one of my favorite purchases that I've made three times by accident. <laughs> I, one of my favorite purchases that I made accidentally three times in 2020. 2021, sorry. I forgot it's 2022 now. Hey! I'm gonna put all the extra stuff into this little bag just to keep it safe. And then, hey Manny the Mammoth, how you doing today? And then I gotta tighten this up more. I'm gonna switch cameras while I tighten this. Okay, I tightened it up like as much as I could. Actually, this is really good. The only thing I don't like about it is that this kind of dangles, but I know you can like loop it back through and make it to where it doesn't tangle as much, but this is how the grip works and it's just really nice. You can just, you're like, if you're worried you're gonna drop it, it's gonna be, but, so it's really nice. Why are you streaming on Amazon? I have been streaming on Amazon for two years and I just stream to kind of help people if they have items or products that I have personally, I can kind of tell you about them. So for example, if you have questions about that monitor that I have, I can like give you advice or help or something. And that's why I stream on Amazon. I really like it on Amazon. It is a lot, uh, what do you call it? It's nicer than streaming on Twitch. I've streamed on Twitch for 10 years, so it's a long time. This I bought during Black Friday, one of my favorite Black Friday purchases of all time. Uh, it's a, what is this? The Samsung 970 EVO Plus NMVE M.2 2 terabyte um, SSD, which is really nice. I wanted this so that I could upgrade my laptop memory. Um, I love my laptop. It's super cool. I wanted to show you guys something really cool with my laptop. So I'm gonna put this camera aside for now and I'm probably gonna quickly talk about my PC stuff and then I will go into talking about my laptop. So in my PC, as you probably already know, all of the fans in my PC are, whew, that's my whole PC. So all the fans in my PC are the NCXT AER um, RGB2 uh, fans, which are really awesome. They're super silent. They don't make any sound. They're incredible. Uh, the uh, GPU I have inside of my PC is the Asus Tough uh, 3090, which is really nice. How do those compare to Western Digital Blue or Black? To be very honest with you, I am kind of a Samsung fanboy and I've never bought Digital Blue, uh, or sorry, Western Digital. Um, I have one Western Digital, but it is not a NMBE M.2. It is just a normal SSD. And I mean, that was great. I, I still use it today, it's awesome. Hi Mike! Also inside my computer, I have got the Lian Li. Uh, I don't know who Chris is, I'm sorry. Your name is Chris, Amazon customer? My name is Atera. And uh, my channel is called Aterabyte because I like talking about tech. So it's like Atara. A lot of people can't say my name right. A lot of people will just call me Atara, which is fine if you call me Atara, but I thought it would be clever if I just named my channel Aterabyte because my name is Atara. But yeah, your name is Chris. There's two Chrises. Oh my gosh. But yeah, the clutch. Oh yeah, I was gonna go grab my laptop, right? Yeah, I'm gonna go grab my laptop. Hey, Jimmy, how you doing today? Yeah. 
So two other tech things that I bought in 2021 is this awesome laptop and then my iPad. Both are super cool. And uh, this is getting out of hand. <laughs> now there's two of them. Which one is the evil clone? I think I know Chris with the K is, uh, you're my Chris. <laughs> hey, how you doing today? Oh, I've got my iFixit kit, which I use for taking apart, uh, taking apart and building my computers and stuff. It's really awesome. You just open it up. It's got everything in here. Boop. Um, inside of my PC, I also have the NZXT Z73 uh, 360 AIO cooler, which is really amazing. And then I also have a five inch mini monitor, which is cool. Um, another thing I use all the time is my Elgato stream deck. It's the best thing ever for streaming, but I want to talk about this laptop, laptop, laptop. Okay. So first off, I'm going to scroll to the very beginning or sorry, the very end of my products. And let me plug this in. Oh, I hope it's, uh, I was having some USB issues before. Let me turn on my laptop. Plug in this. I'm gonna switch to this real fast so I can... Oh wait, that's right, this one doesn't have the password. Oops. Um, I forgot how to do this. I hope my USB-Cs are working. My hair is a mess today, I gotta fix that. US... I'm hearing music. Hi everyone, my name is PP. Lesson I want to share with you guys. Oh, there we, it's the internet. I gotta turn that off. Okay. USBs are still being pretty sus. I don't know what's going on. Let me uh, turn down the brightness a lot though, so you can actually see it. Um, Then I need to look up the program Luna. Yeah, there it is. Oh, the NCXT cooler is so awesome. And then this right here is my iPad. And I've been drawing lately on it, so I can show you a picture I drew of my dog. Here's a picture I drew of my dog the yesterday. <laughs> I drew it yesterday, isn't it cute? It's my hero. I gave him glasses because the picture I drew it from was a picture of hero. So I drew this all in Procreate. So if I like take away, this is the shadowing. Honestly, it almost doesn't need any shadowing. This is the color layer. So here's just the line art. I like how I did the paw completely separately from everything else. This is like a kind of small little tint. And then the line art is here. Oh, that looks so creepy without line art. <clears throat> but yeah, so this is the iPad Pro. But what is cool is I got this device, which allows me to turn this into, let me turn down the brightness a little or a lot. Um, I got a device that allows me to use this as another monitor on my laptop. I'm forgetting how to use this device. <laughs> I don't remember how to use iPods, I iPads. Do I trade crypto? Uh, I don't really trade it. Um, There we go. It does cost a lot of money, that's for sure. I just gotta connect this. same Wi-Fi? Hold on. Let me check if I have a USB-C to USB-C cable. Oh yeah, of course I do. Right here. USB-C! Uh, 
Um, but yeah, so I was thinking of taking my laptop today to upgrade the memory. Uh, to up add this um, two terabyte to it, but I have to take it to the Samsung store. It's super cheap. I just don't want to void the warranty of my laptop because I really, really like it. I am having USB-C issues. What is going on? I think I do have to take my laptop in anyways. Darn it, it's not even working. Wait, let's see, USB, not recognize. It malfunctioned and Windows does not recognize it. Yeah, I'm having some serious uh, USB issues lately with my laptop. That's unfortunate. I love my laptop. I'll get it fixed though. It was working like the other day too. Maybe I gotta just factory reset my laptop. Yeet Windows 10 or Windows 11. I don't know what happened. It was the last Windows update. Windows 11 though, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have updated. Why didn't I do it? Someone said it was a good idea, so I trusted him. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? There's more updates for USB. Keep your, keep your laptops up to date. Um, so if you see my computer back here, I have two monitors. The one on the bottom is the Samsung Odyssey G9. And the one on the top is the Samsung Odyssey G7. Literally nobody uses Windows 11. You should watch Cobra Kai. I did see a lot of Cobra Kai. It was pretty funny. Um, I want to make a new PC. Wait, I want to make a new, my, wait, I want to make a new PC. Oh, wait, mine was around $800, but I want a better one. Oh, yeah, that'd be awesome. Hey, you got the stream working today. That's awesome. Wait, did I add the GPU twice? That's weird. I didn't mean to do that. I put a lot of stuff in my carousel today. Where did I leave off at the beginning? There, there's so much stuff in here. The Elgato key lights. Oh, you know what's weird is you can see my microphone right there. I'm gonna move that. And then let me see if I can bring this up a little so you can actually see the key lights. Yeah, you can see way more stuff now. I'm just like low over here. But um, behind me, I have the Elgato key light, so I can turn them on and off. That one's not turning on or off. Why is all my stuff malfunctioning when I stream? That's super weird, honestly. Maybe it's bad luck. <laughs> I'm going to uninstall the updates. Can I do that? Can I uninstall all of these updates? Yeah, I can. What's the stream without technical difficulties? Well, I've actually had this problem since like last week, but for some reason on my laptop, my, uh, USBs aren't working anymore. And it's like, if I can't use USBs, what's the point of you, laptop? <laughs> it was weird too, cause I like updated it and then it was like, nope, goodbye. So maybe I have to kind of Let me try that. I'm gonna unplug this and plug it back in. I'm still kind of messing around with my laptop while I do other things. It says the device might need more power. Your PC might not provide enough power to the USB device. That's the thing though. I don't need it to be powered. <laughs> it's trying to charge it. So I might have to go into the settings and then like turn that off. But like don't, don't power things. Boop, boop, boop. 
Oh, hey, this is a common problem. Why? Why did Windows 11 break me? At least it's still charging. That's a good thing. Connection might be fried? What? No! <laughs> no! I'll cry. Don't break my beautiful laptop. It's the only one in pink. They don't make this one. They don't make this laptop in pink anymore. Nani? It's in blue, but pink is just so much better, in my personal opinion. <laughs> Let's just turn off all of these. Wait, what are you talking about? Hey, how about you just work, USB? Bam! Work, work, work. Let's go. Your laptop's at 2%? You really gotta charge that thing. Am I gonna stream on Prime Day? Absolutely. I'm excited for Prime Day already, and it hasn't even started yet, but what I like about Prime Day is it's like right before my little brother's birthday, so it's always awesome to stream uh, on Prime Day and then see all the cells and then immediately buy things for my little brother. I kind of spoil my little brother, but I literally, when I was a kid, I like wished for him. What? Oh, it's not recognizing this? Hip hip hooray! What? You aren't recognizing? Yo, USBs. Okay. Oh, you finally got the Pokemon Sprite gifts? Yeah, that's awesome. I need to play, I need to finish Pokemon. I do. Yeah, when I, when I was a little kid, I literally like, uh, my mom's like, what do you want for your birthday? And I was like, I want a little brother. And then my mom was like, oh, guess what? I'm going to have a baby. And I was like, I hope it's a little brother. <laughs> That's all I was like, cool, mom. It better be a boy. I already have a little sister, so I didn't want two little sisters. Even though I, I would have loved to have a little sister. If I had to have had a little sister. Oh, for Diamond and Pearl? Yeah, I need to play more. Yeah, my USB-Cs are broken. I gotta tell them that. I think I'm gonna go to that store today and be like, hey, upgrade my laptop. Also, fix this. Also, my USB-Cs are broken. Um, and I'm too lazy to fix it myself. <laughs> Please fix. <laughs> Thank you, Samsung. What else was I gonna talk about? Oh yeah, another thing I got. Okay, so I'm gonna retire my poor little, my poor little iPad and my poor little laptop. I'm gonna put them to the side. But I wanna show you one more time. Look at the little hero I drew. Wait, it's too bright. I drew this yesterday and I'm super proud of it. Do you have time after stream? Um, maybe. I have to call my mom. So, uh, my mom's not doing too well right now. So I gotta call her right after the stream. And then after I call my mom, I am free. I just don't know how long I'll be on the phone with her. Me and my mom like to talk a lot. Uh... Another thing I got recently, which I love, are these right here. The Rode microphones. So I got these, I used to have a different microphone set, but then I got these ones and, oh man, they're amazing. They're incredible. 
Uh, I forgot how to turn them on. <laughs> they're amazing. They're incredible. I don't know how to use them. I've used them like twice. Actually, I used to use them for my stream a lot uh, because they were really, really, really nice for the stream. I can probably use these with uh, my GoXLR Mini when I get it. Yeah, I finally got these. Um, I really, really wanted them for a while. So I was like, they they were on sale during Black Friday. And I was finally like, you know what? It's time. I need to get these. I'm going to turn off my laptop real quick. Shut down. I really need to take some time and then like actually fix the USB-Cs on my laptop if I don't get them fixed today. Yeah. They're so amazing. They're actually as good as everyone says they are. And what's cool is I could use them with my computer as well. So like streaming. So like, for example, if I wanted to, I could just plug these in and like go way back there. Uh, me because of half the things on the wish list. Yeah, I'm really happy with these. Another thing I got to like kind of compliment them, which I love, but I'm also kind of bummed out about is the Lavier mic. So I got this and I loved it and I got white because uh, I mostly only wear white clothes So I thought if I got black it would like stick out too much if I wore all white I love it But the sad thing is it turned yellow on the tip and I really I don't know how to fix that I don't know why it did that. I It just kind of just turned yellow and so that kind of bums me out. I don't like that the tip turned yellow I wish it was white again, but um these along with these are so nice so you just simply plug it into there attach this to my shirt and then good to go and the quality is so good it does come in black yeah it comes in black but i bought the white one and i'm kind of bummed out because the white one was a little more expensive than the black one but now i'm kind of regretting getting the white because the tip turned yellow so i'm gonna google if there's ways to clean that or reverse the tip from being yellow um but yeah, it does come in black and the black one is the more common one to get. I just wanted white because I wear white clothes and I was like, oh, it'll blend in better, you know? But yeah, I'm super happy with these. One of my favorite things that I bought in 2021. I need to use them more. I need to make YouTube videos, but I have just been so busy doing other things that's not YouTube. <laughs> it also comes with these cute little fluffy things and it tells you how to like turn them, twist them on like that uh these are just like little wind covers because you don't actually have to have the laviar mic i could clip it like right here or like under my shirt like i could clip it like right here that looks a little weird but stuff like that shaving cream interesting i'll have to try that or even like using a marker and like marking it white again i don't know just something it'd be nice I don't like that it turned yellow. I think it lo it looks gross. I don't know. You're down to help? I have a few ideas for YouTube videos. Um, there's just, I, I think I'm waiting until I either like move or something. I know I should just start, but um, I kind of, I kind of want to get like LASIK surgery too. So I'm like waiting because I'm like, Oh man, maybe I should get my wait till the surgery and then do you start doing it regularly? I don't know. I'm making up a lot of excuses to not do it when in reality all I gotta do is just do it. You know, like Shia LaBeouf says, do it. Don't let tomorrow wait. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Do it. He's right, you know. But um, another thing I got which I love so much is my DJI Pocket 2 camera. This is so, okay, I love this thing so much because I got the color in white too. I got this one also in white because I just, I like, I like that it, okay, white has, white looks good, but it sucks because it gets dirty easily. But I got it in white and um, I think it's so awesome because I can just easily put this in my purse. So I just throw this thing in my purse and wherever I go, I can just take it out quickly, turn it on and like film a quick video. Um, and then it's got the stabilization there. So it like makes sure it's very stabilized. And then if I go to, let's see, where's my stuff? 
If I go here, um, when I was at Disneyland with my little brother, I took a few videos. It even has sound and everything. Oh, this is when we were on the roller coaster thing. I'll have to upload this. That's funny. Ah, don't delete it! <laughs> no! Where's the other ones? This one, I'm just bright white. That's funny. I took it on a roller coaster. You can't even see it, but oh man, I'm gonna have to upload these. That's funny. Um, so this thing I love, it's got a hole down here for a tripod. And then this piece right here is to add an extra, is to add a microphone. So one thing I did is I bought this DJI microphone, which is right here. And then I used this Lavier mic with it actually. Um, and then I just kind of clipped it under my shirt. And the audio is so amazing with this thing too. So I used this camera at Disneyland. It was super awesome to just quickly take out of my purse and film anything whenever, which I really, really liked. I feel like this thing is awesome for probably like vlogging and it's got the stabilizer and everything. And just like quickly like just taken out to make memories real fast. Like it's so easy. I really, really like it. Um, probably one of the coolest cameras ever. Oh, I didn't see it. I used to clean white shoes. I need that kind of advice. Thank you. I think I already mentioned the Peak Design um, capture clip. Here's this one. Um, this one's actually Myths. I have one and mine is silver. So this is mine. Uh, when I was at Disneyland, I kind of just clipped this to my purse. So I had this inside my purse. I clipped this to my purse and then I kind of just put my camera uh, clipped into here and it's not going anywhere. It's super secure. It's really nice. I just clipped it to my purse and then I walked around and then anytime I wanted to take a picture, I would just, what is this little hair doing? Anytime I wanted to take a picture, I just unclip it real fast, take my photos and then go. It's really awesome. I, uh, yeah, you have to clip this in and pull it up. Does that save to an SD card? Yeah, it actually does. So you can put an SD card right in here. Uh, I have it on a 64, wow. I didn't know that I bought a 64 just for this one. Um, that's quite big. <laughs> that's actually a lot larger than I thought I had. I thought it was only a 32 in there. Ah, stay in. Atera the spy. Do I seem like a spy? Oh, what else is cool? Okay, so let me show you another cool thing about this bad boy. Um, I know we kind of moved on, but I want to go back and talk about it because I think it's super cool. Um, so, okay. I got my little handy dandy cell phone here. Um, inside the little case here. I don't know if they all come with this case or if only my white edition one did. Um, but you can take this piece off right here. And then you kind of just swoop on. Goodbye, Chris. You kind of just swoop on this. And then, uh, of course, you got to turn on the machine. And then you can plug it into your phone like that. Okay. And then it launches up the app. And then from the app, you can actually go to the play button here. And then you can upload all of your videos that you took. So here's me and my brother in a bunch of places. Let's see. I wonder if I can show you one, this one on here. So here's me and my brother on a roller coaster in Disneyland. It's so cool, yeah. That's one thing too, is like, I can instantly take photos with this. You can take pictures or videos. And then you instantly just plug it into your phone. Um, it's got a, it's got an Apple one and a Samsung one. So there's the Apple one and I'm using the Samsung one now. My ears almost fell off. Oh my, <laughs> my, my brother. <laughs> and the quality of the sound is like really good actually. It was really awesome to hang out with my brother at Disneyland. I had a lot of fun. Let's see this one. This one I think I was at the Cars roller coaster. So we're like zooming around super fast. And it also has this clip like a Wii remote so you don't have to worry about it slipping out of your hands or anything. My hair is just everywhere. I don't know what this one is but I'm about to find out. You can live stream using that, yeah. So you can uh, put in your, uh... wait, let me turn this down a little. 
I don't know what roller coaster that was, but I only took like a few seconds of it. Oh, it was the Cars place, I think. Or is it? Yeah, it is the Cars. Yeah, it can do 1080p and 4K. And you can stream with it, you just instantly... I could stream Amazon. I could stream straight to Amazon using this device, which I've thought about doing a few times. Oh, this is just a picture I took. Is this one a video? Yeah, here's a video. That's my brother. But um, this particular one, it's in a low res preview, but if I take it off my phone and go into the settings here, let me switch this real fast back to this one. So if I go back to here, you can kind of like swoop down. So I filmed all of these in 1080p, but you can go over to here and then you click on the video. Oops. Go on video and you can do uh, 1080p, uh, 4K, 2.7K, and then you can choose your frame rate. So 60, 30, 25, 24. You can choose the frame rate you want as well. Uh, there's also other options. So your photo options, you can do a panorama, you can do a story mode, which is always really cool. You can do slow mode, you can do HDR video, and then a time lapse as well. So it has a lot of options on this thing. And then also you can choose the resolution. You also choose things like, um, it's really customizable actually. You also choose things like um, beauty mode. So it like just makes your skin look better. You also turn it off at any point, which I think is cool. So if you accidentally left beauty mode on and you're recording a video and your face just looks too beautified, um, then in the preview mode, like if you put it on your phone, you can flip that button and just completely turn it off. So it doesn't like permanently record over it, which I think is really awesome. But yeah, this thing is cool. One of my favorite purchases of 2021. What time is it now? Okay, it is 11.47, 11.24, 11.27, But Yeah, so I got these awesome mics. I gotta turn these off so they don't die. Goodbye, Chris. Turn this one off too. There we go. And what else can I talk about? I bought some new AirPods. I have broken three pairs of AirPods. <laughs> Somehow, I broke three pairs of AirPods. So I got some new AirPod Pros. They're just the older model, but they're really cheap, so. Uh, it does not have a place for a SIM card. So you do need a phone to stream on it. I wish it did. Did this little hair break? No, little hair, don't be broken. No. That sounds really cheap and not durable. Okay, well, the way they broke. So the first pair broke because I left them. I don't know where I left them, but Hero ate them. So that's how I broke one pair of AirPod Pros. <laughs> The second pair of AirPod Pros I broke uh, by charging them using the wrong charger. And then I think I fried them. So that that also is my bad. But yeah, they're pretty much my science experiment at this point. <laughs> oh yeah, this Anchor webcam I've been using a lot lately, especially during all my streams, my quarantine streams. I use this for all my quarantine streams when I was in quarantine. Good times. I hope I don't go back. Oh, I got this Anchor USB-C hub. When my laptop used USB-Cs, this worked awesome because I just plug it in and then I plug in my, uh, what do you call it? This thing? I plug this into it? The cam link? I plug the cam link into it and then I would do the kitchen streams that I do when I make stuff in the kitchen. Um, for some reason, my USB-Cs just aren't working and I really don't know why. It's kind of weird. I'll have to figure it out and get them fixed at some point, but yeah, that's some of my tech that I have bought during 2021 and that I have loved during 2021 <laughs> and I'll probably love for longer too. Like this, I'm so excited for. This, I just really love. I like to take videos of 
anything, just throwing it in my purse. You can even put it in your pocket, which is really nice. Um, you can put it in your pocket, you can put it in your purse, and then you just take it out and film. I've never tried the Sennheiser wireless earbuds, but they're probably amazing. Sennheiser just is an amazing, is just incredible quality all around. I had some Sennheiser wireless headphones a long time ago, and I got them kind of for free. Like at Best Buy, they had a promotion where if you upgraded your phone, you got a $300 Best Buy gift card. So they were $300, but I upgraded my phone and then got that gift card and then bought those. <laughs> I miss when they used to do promotions like that. They just don't do it anymore. I feel like they used to have so much stuff like that. Like you'd upgrade your Samsung phone and you got like a free like SD card or you got a free charger or VR headset. And now I feel like they're just like, upgrade your phone or else you don't have a good phone. <laughs> How is the tearing? I haven't had any tearing issues whatsoever. I usually play on 244 hertz, but of course some games are capped, so a lot of games I play will only go up to like, or sorry, 240 hertz. Some games I play will only go to 144 hertz. I bet the sound quality is amazing. Ah, this little hair is driving me crazy. I don't know when I broke my hair here. Just have a single bang. I miss those days. Yeah, right? It was nice when you got free stuff for buying stuff. Good times, good times. Do I think the Peak Design camera clip is worth the $70? I, yes, I definitely think so. I, I it took me months to finally buy the capture clip because uh, personally, um, I've got two of them. So I've got this one and I have the silver one. So it took me months to finally break down and buy one. I bought myself the silver one um, and like I said, the reason why I bought it was because I went on a trip to Disneyland and I didn't want to carry around my camera. I didn't want to carry around my camera like the whole time and because um, it gets heavy and it sucks. So I ended up breaking down and I finally bought one of these and I don't regret it at all. In fact, here, let me show you uh, ways that I use it. So let me go grab my purse and just kind of demonstrate how I like to use it. Actually, this might work too. Let me grab this one. Oh, let me grab my purse too. So I don't wear belts. If you wear belts, I think it's even better. I don't wear belts though. So I've got like my fanny packs. And let me, if I like attach this fanny pack, I'm gonna tighten it though. So if I attach this fanny pack, like so, hold on, let me apply this clip to it. So it easily just, you unscrew it like this and it kind of just, um, hold on, I need to unscrew it more. Kind of flips up like this, so it's super simple. You have some really nice chairs, thank you. Yeah, these are the new chairs I recently bought that I was like super excited about. Okay, I'm just gonna attach this to my fanny pack right here. And then, hold on, let me show you how this works. So you can screw it on here and you gotta get it like pretty tight. And then I'm gonna clip this fanny pack on like so. I like to wear fanny packs cause I just don't like, I don't know, I'm not a backpack person. So I've got my handy dandy fanny pack here that I would normally be wearing like at Disneyland or something. I've got my capture clip here. And then here is the, um, so this is the clip for the bottom. And then this is the cap, the uh, Peak Design, whatchamacallit? Peak Design um, clutch. Are you a belt person? Wait. Ah. Why is it suddenly getting in my way? What am I doing wrong? Did I put it on the wrong thing? Am I putting it in the wrong way? I am putting it in the wrong way. Okay, so 
this is what it would look like if you put it in angled wise. Normally I put it down this way, but it's uh, being a little weird on my fanny pack. But you can see like, it's really sturdy. You can shake, I can jump, it's not going anywhere. And it just, when it's not diagonal like this, when it's actually going up and down, it's actually quite comfortable. Have I been to Lotte World in Korea yet? Yes, I have been to Lotte World. Let me figure out why I can't get this to work. Like this. Why aren't you working? Does it not go in that way? I swear it does. It might be this. Is in the way. And so stylish with my fanny pack. You can buy another piece to this puzzle. Which I have to find because I don't know what I did with it and I really didn't want to lose it because I really loved it. What did I do with it? Hold on, let me check down here. Check the magic box of wonders! It's not here! Why do I lose my expensive stuff? Ah! Well, let me show you another one. Since I can't get this one right. So I'm just going to take this one off of here. I got the silver because I like the lighter colors, but if you're, all your stuff's black, I feel like the black one would probably be better. Here's my cute little backpack. It's got small straps, but I'll show you how it works with this too. So we're just gonna go whoop. Hey, thank you so much. Let me go over to this. Well, I'll leave it here for now. Okay. So I will tighten this on here. Tighten this side up really good. Let me put the backpack on. Oh, I made that way too high up there. I don't often wear backpacks, but... Okay, I'm just gonna make it to where it's comfortable. So like probably right about there is really comfortable. And then I can tighten it up like so. And then you can take your camera and just clip it. Yeah, I'm really glad I bought this. Uh, I, I uh, was like really hesitant to spend the, uh, so this backpack is really loose. Like the straps are really loose, so it kind of wobbles a little. But I was really hesitant to spend the $70 to buy this clip, but I'm really happy I did. After I bought one, I immediately went and bought another one. <laughs> After, because I was like, okay, I love this thing, it's perfect. It's like not going anywhere. You could tumble down a, I don't know, you could tumble down a hill and it won't fall off. Okay, let's get this out. And then, um, my favorite place to put it is on my favorite purse. So the fanny pack is awesome, but this is my favorite purse. Oh, wait, I like to put it this way because I like how you can see there's an indent right there for me putting it on here so often. But I usually put it like right here on my favorite purse. Actually, let's bring it down a little more. Put it like right here. And then you can just clip it right here. So when I was at Disneyland, this is how I carried my camera around. So I'd have it like this. Right now it's being a little flimsy. But I'd have it like this and just have my purse and then my camera kind of hang in there and then I had my hands free. And I really like to have my hands free. And then if I was worried, I could just grab the clutch and then unclip this and then take photos. So I really, really, really like that clip. It's awesome. Thank you for asking that question, by the way. I like to demonstrate stuff. I think it's a lot of fun. Anyways, I have been streaming for more than an hour. My hair is being weird. I don't know what to do with it. And uh, I am gonna end the stream now for today. I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. 
Wait, I'm looking at the wrong camera. I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. And uh, I will see you tomorrow. I'm going to try and fix my USB Cs on my laptop. I was going to build Mewtwo and I completely forgot. I ran out of time. But I'll do that tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try and fix the USB Cs on my laptop. And if I can't fix them, I'm going to go to the Samsung store and be like, fix this, please. But I hope you guys have a nice day. Goodbye. Sleep well, sweet dreams. Happy New Year, everyone. Goodbye, Mike. Goodbye, Brain Slugs. <laughs>